I'm having problems with the wipers and have code B2304 or B2305, which indicates the wiper park switch is stuck in the low or high setting. Quickly, these are all the tools and supplies you need to gather. I'll put all of these in the description below. A quick like and subscribe is always appreciated. So, I'll show a possible quick solution on how to fix this before changing the actual wiper motor mount, which is located under the driver's side right here, or the actual wiper arms just above, or worse, the TIPM, the Total Integrated Power Module. I have separate videos on these you can check out later. It'll be in the description below. Anyway, once the hood is open, locate the fuse box on the passenger side. Look directly behind the washer fluid next to the red positive jumper port area. Push on the tab and lift up the cover. Lots of fuses here. Anyway, at the top, there are two black relays and a pink J-case fuse blow it. Now, sometimes these are just not in tight enough. So you could just pull it out and then put it back in and see if the code goes away and that your wipers are good again. However, if it doesn't, I'm going to remove these and or replace if necessary. First, let me explain these. The left relay is the on-off switch for the wipers and the relay on the right sends power to the wiper motor and specifically allows the wipers to operate the high and low speed settings, the speediness of the wiper movement. Now equally as important is the pink 30 amp J case fuse. This provides power to both of the wiper relays above. The pink fuse is easy to check on. Just look at the clear cover and see if the fuse is dark or has blown or not. Usually, these are good, but if bad, then pop this out and replace with another one. Once you determine the pink fuse is good, let's move on to the most likely problem here, which is the wiper relays. I'll remove each one with the pliers, but you could also remove it with your hand if preferred. One is out, I'll grab the other one, and now let's go test each one. I'll briefly explain these relays but you can check out a more detailed video on how this works if interested. I'll put that in the description. Anyway, there's a diagram here and then there's numbers on this side. These numbers correspond to this diagram. So you'll connect in this order, 86, then the other corner, 85, then connect 30, followed by the last corner, 87. 87A is not to be connected, which is the middle one. This will all make sense shortly. You'll see. Grab a battery. In this case, I'm using my power drill battery. And I'm using some alligator clips to connect the leads to this. Now I'm going to connect one lead to number 85. And now I'm just going to tap number 86. You should hear a sound. A click sound. I know it's good. So I can move on to the next step. Go ahead and leave that connected. Go ahead and grab some more alligator clips and connect them to your leads. Set your multimeter to the ohms. This one right here. Now go ahead and connect the other corners, which is 30 and 87. And you want your reading to be as close as possible to zero. This might fluctuate this number because there's resistance, but it's pretty close to zero, so I know this is still very good. If it was a lot higher the number, you may want to consider placing the relay. After testing the relays, let's go back to the car. If this has helped so far, please hit the like button and subscribe. And tell me if this relay test was straight to the point. I would like to know. Okay, now let's go back to the car. And quickly reinstall, push both of them in. While you're here, it's also good to test all the other fuses and this right here is the starter relay, which also gets bad. I have a different video you can check out to fix this one as well. I'll leave that as well as all the tools and supplies used in the description below. But anyway, this simple relay replacement fixed my wiper issues. I hope it fixes yours. Let me know in the comments, and if you haven't already, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching, drive safely, and heck, 
I guess I'll turn these wipers off now. Right? Bye.